Good morning. This here is a notification from the EPA. We've been assessed a total penalty of over a million dollars for failure to comply with the Clean Air Act, Clean Water Act, and Toxic Substances Control Act. This is the third time in as many years that we've failed to fully comply. If this news gets out to the media, our share price is going south. This is it. We cannot continue to run our business this way. How can we promote a more green and sustainable culture in our organization? Are there any new ideas that benefit us and the general environment? Ron, it all starts at the source. A significant part of our risk is actually inherited from our vendors who supply us with the raw materials. We should start green purchasing with suppliers that have responsible environmental management. We should run our machines on solar power and install modern equipment to control carbon emissions and chemical effluents from our factories. Come to think of it, even simple actions like eliminating plastic and styrofoam coffee cups, turning off lights, and shutting down computers at the end of the day can make a significant difference in reducing waste. All these mean long-term savings of at least 5-8% to of operating costs and reduction of greenhouse emissions by 8-12% to annually. This is exactly what DuPont did five years ago. Obviously, implementing all of this is going to be an expensive proposition. How will our customers respond if we go green? Mr. Sherman, customers care about the general behavior of brands. They are more likely to buy our products if we go green. If we sell ourselves as an environmentally sensitive company, we'll be ahead of our competition and we can make some serious gains in revenue. Well son, do you see this symbol? That means this product is EPA approved. This is made by a company that cares about the environment. If we buy from companies that don't care, then by the time you grow up the environment could be in grave and irreversible danger. That's good to hear. Will this take our share price up? Of course, Mr. Sherman. Investors do value a company that is seen as environmentally friendly. For example, take Dr. and Bramble. Their share price shot up by 60% in the last 18 months after they were awarded the green ticker, indicating their status as a green company on the stock exchange. Going green will definitely increase our share prices. Alright, sounds good to me. Looks like we have all the ideas we need. Let's get started on an investment plan and a timeline. Let's go green.